Hello again. I have question 35. They say study the opposite circuit and find the electromotive force of the battery. So I need to find EMF here of the battery. Okay. Uh, I know the formula. Let me first start with the formula. Guys, I know that electromotive force, either you call it E or epsilon, it doesn't matter. Uh, it is actually the current multiple the external resistance plus the internal resistance, right? So I have the internal resistance right here, which is 10 ohm. I have the current right here, which is 5 ampere. What is the external? It's actually the total of these three. Okay, so first I find the external resistance and then I can uh, uh, apply this formula. Okay, so let's start. I have 8 and 4 connected in series. So the total of them is going to be 8 plus 4, which is 12 ohm. So, uh, okay, I will erase these two. And I can draw only one resistor here. All of it, this one, blah, 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 blah. It is 12 ohm. Now, the 12 and 4, they are connected in parallel. So. Uh, the total of them is actually uh, the total of this of the external okay so it's going to be 1 over 12 plus 1 over 4 right to the power negative 1 and this will give me 3 ohm okay now we go back uh, to this formula to find the electromotive force okay which equals uh, i which is the Five. No need to write it again. I will write just five. And here I have uh, external plus internal. Okay. Uh, which is going to be five multiple 13, which is, I guess, 65 volts. So this is the electromotive force of the uh, battery. Okay. Uh, it's a quite simple question, right? I hope it's clear. If you have anything you want to say, please leave it under the video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.